Okay, you guys, so we are back. It's the next morning. Last night was Evian's birthday party. She aged up into an adult, and she moved out on us. So the house is a little bit emptier, but guess what? It's love day. I believe everyone is going to be home today. You know Maria would like to have some alone time with Alejandro, but it's just not going to happen today, honey. And everyone's hungry. Everyone was drinking and partying last night. They were not concerned about food. Everybody was getting turned up. And Maria couldn't help and notice that, you know, she got a little jealous at the party. And as you see, that jealousy is still eating away at her. But she'll be fine. I mean, it's not like Alejandro's going to stay with Raquel forever. I mean, clearly she doesn't want to break up a happy home, but he's not happy with Raquel. He's happy with Maria, isn't he? She don't know, but we got to figure it out, though. I was thinking that maybe in a couple of days, we should plan some type of rendezvous. I mean, Alejandro works from home now. So what if he had to, like, go out of town on business? And what if Maria said that she needed to go back to Colombia just for the week to make sure her ailing abuela was okay? By the way, her grandma is just fine. And then they could meet up and have a nice vacation together. Just for a few days. Then Maria can know what it really be like to be a couple with him without having to hide so much. Obviously, they would still have to be careful because paparazzi will follow Alejandro wherever they go. Anyway, today we're not discussing that, though. Today we have another problem. A huge scandal has hit. Saying that Alejandro has been arrested, which we all know is not true. But he's still going to have to go down to the courthouse today and deal with it. So Maria's extra fun special time that she likes to have with him is going to have to wait. In fact, they probably won't get any time together since he'll probably be in the courthouse for most of the morning. It's unfortunate, but hey. But hey, that's what happens when you're a celebrity. People like to make up stories about you. Maria has to go to the bathroom so badly. Don't worry, honey. We're sending you right now. At least she was finally able to eat. She was so hungry. Of course, we're going to have to start cleaning up this house as soon as we're done. But I think it would be really nice for Maria and Alejandro to get away with each other. I mean, not like we'll be missing much. Charles isn't aging up for a while. And Raquel, what's Raquel going to do? Raquel doesn't like to travel with Alejandro anyway. Being on planes for too long makes her sick. Let's see, we got to take out the trash. Is the trash overflowing at this point? I don't know. Anyway, it looks like we do have trash. I think the mailbox might still be broken, to be honest with you. We'll try it, though. Did Alejandro just come in on me in the shower? Alejandro, you dirty dog. And we are both totally comfortable with it. You could have joined me in there, honey. You know that. He can go in now. I won't stop you, baby. See? I have no problem with you dropping trout in front of me, baby. I like to see it all. Anyway, though, we got to get back to cleaning this house. I'm just glad that it doesn't seem like anyone is suspicious. Uh, son, you're gonna have to wait. Everyone's still in the bathrooms. Yeah, you just walked in on your daddy. Yeah. Don't worry. It's okay. Your dad forgives you. I'm sure of it. He didn't. He didn't finish taking his shower, but that's okay. We're going to um send him to the courthouse so he can sue for slander. Cause they're totally making up lies about him, and it's not okay. Okay, so let's go over to the courthouse. Sue for a slander. It's only $517. I don't care. It's the principle of the matter. They've been lying on us. Yes, Alejandro has been having an affair on his wife, Raquel. But he was not arrested. Sick of the lies. Oh, uh, Ra Raquel is like watching us watch the shower, really? You're really going to sit there and watch us while we clean the shower? Really? Really? Raquel, like, seriously, is this your life now? You just watch us clean things that you could be cleaning? It's okay. You just don't know we are sleeping in your mind, honey. Let's clean up Charles' room. Oh, no one's ever going to be sleeping in Evian's room again. Like, let's put her stuff in storage, though. I can't believe our girl is gone. Now let's sell all her things. <laughs> oh, oh, hmm. I guess if Alejandro wants, this could be like his study, his room just for him. And maybe a <clears throat> special friend. So how about we put like a nice, comfy couch in there? That looks comfy. In fact, let's get him like a really nice setup for his office. Make sure he has a nice drink on his desk at all times. 
Make sure his favorite bottle of whiskey is there in case he ever wants to have a little something something to drink. I think he'll be happy with that. And let's make it so that no one can disturb Alejandro when he's in there. So, Mrs. Solano can't come in. Mr. Charles Solano cannot come in. Only Maria can come in because, you know, she has to clean and whatnot. <laughs> oh, you know, that couch is there if he has, like, company for business, of course. For business. Gotta put away this food when we get a chance, too. Raquel's not going to work today. Uh, I'm sure Raquel can find something to do herself. She and Charles should go out today. Mrs. Solano's gonna be out at the courthouse anyhow. Her and her son should have, like, a fun day out. Um, hmm. Where to go, though? Why don't they get something to eat at a nice restaurant? Why don't they take a tour of the movie lot? I mean, her daughter's working there now. They can, you know, maybe pop in and say hello to her. That sounds like fun. What better way to spend Love Day than with your daughter, telling her how much you love her and you can't wait to see her. So sweet. There we go. We're finally taking out this trash. We're also throwing out the garbage. <laughs> Oops. A pool party at Nick's house. Spring house party, huh? We'll be there. And of course, we gotta go get the laundry now. Uh, we still haven't put that food away, though. We'll do that after we get the clean laundry out. Anyway, it looks like Maria's excited to attend the party, but obviously she doesn't want anything to do with Nick. And she doesn't even know what we know about Nick. You know what I mean? Alejandro's still in the courthouse. They're still enjoying the set at the movie. He wants to get a part-time job. Um, I agree he should get a part-time job. Doing what? I don't know. Oh, the party's already started. Raquel's invited. Yes, Raquel. Let's all go to the party that your man is having. Um, he'll meet us there later. Oh, but we all going to this party, though. All going to the party. Second, she said, I want to attend it with my son. No, he wants to, like, prank the house. We're all going to the party, though. What was the attire again? Did it say? Because I don't know. Hopefully, it's just a normal, like, house party. You know what I mean? Still got mail in there. That, that mailbox is so glitched. Oh, well. And we were all going to the party. We're going to have to take a taxi because all the cars are out of the house right now. Oh, he won. So he will be showing up to the party early then. Fantastic. No, 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 no. Mr. Solano, Mr. Solano, you should come to the party. You should come to the party. Besides, Maria needs to go to the party in case Mr. Solano needs anything. Or Mr. Charles Solano. So there's Nick. We should all get in here then, right? Party time, right? Party. Party. He's thinking about engagements, huh? I'm just gonna, like, sit on the couch. Like, is this the party? Are you leaving, though? Where, what's happening here? Where's he going? Is he leaving? We'll do a friendly introduction with him. Because it looks like he wants to leave. Yeah, come over here, please. Come here, please. Because this is your party, and you're trying to leave it. That's very rude. You know what, then? If we want to go outside, she, she bad-mouthing Maria. Maria, listen, Maria's doing your man. If she wanted to, she could totally destroy your marriage and, like, make you look like a laughing stock. So you better stop. Anyway, I'm going to just talk very nice with Mrs. Solano. I'm going to talk very nice with Mr. Charles. And that will give um, Raquel plenty of time to talk to Nick. She think about hot tubs. Oh, no. What's, is she not going to talk to him, though? You're not going to talk to him, though? Raquel, where are you going? Raquel's going to the hot tub. Is it upstairs? Someone's dumpster's diving. That better not be my son. Get out of that dumpster, son. Get out of that dumpster. This is a nice pool. You know what? Let's all go for a swim, then. Let's go for a swim. He should come to the hot tub, too, then. Son, you are filthy. You are dumpster diving. You must have ate something bad in there or something. Son, I'm so disappointed in you. Where is Nick? This is his party. No, Nick, where do you think you are going, Mr. Nick? You trying to avoid me? Oh, it's too late now. Invite over. Get over here. We're all having a good time by the pool, so you're gonna come have a good time by the pool with us. How about that? I was hoping something juicy would go down, but he's like avoiding. I bet if Raquel asked him to come, he would though. Ask to join. It's up to him now. I won't force it too much. But come on. We know she's doing the dirty, dirty. 
We know it. Maria's at this party in her make outfit still, and it's kind of embarrassing. Oh, but now she's in her swimwear, and she looks hot. There we go. I, I feel bad that my son is sick because he went dumpster diving, but hey, that was his fault. That was all his fault. I think Maria should take a little nap, sunbathe and whatnot. Everyone should get a little sunbathing. So where your little friend at? Where your little friend at? He gonna come join you? He coming? I think he coming. He coming. Yeah, she thinks she's so cute. She thinks she the shit. She don't know. Our body's hotter than yours. We are younger than you. Your man wanna do us and not you. Just so you know, honey. Just so you know. Wish I had a good book on me to read. Oh, let's read this book. We'll, we'll borrow Alejandro's book when she wakes up from her little cat nap. Why don't you guys come out the pool? Sunbathe. Get a nice tan. Let's just happen to be facing the direction of your wife and, you know, her very best friend. Alejandro, why don't you join us? Over here. Charles had to go throw up. Poor baby. He's so sick. We might have to take him home then. Dang it, I was kind of hoping we would catch them in their lies and secrets, but I don't think it's going to happen. And now Alejandro's leaving? No, Alejandro. You know, stay. Well, I'm going to have Maria wake up so she can read her little book. I can't believe it. She didn't incriminate herself, like, at all. It's like we were here for nothing now. Everyone's getting paid time off? Well, that's good, at least. Well, you know, we are invited to the man's house. We might as well go upstairs, then. They can stay down there in the hot tub all they like. Says Alejandro will be up there. And I'm more interested in spending time with him than his wife. He said, thank you, Raquel, for coming to my party. Okay. So the party's over now. All right. Well played, Miss Raquel. Well played. She looks sly. She looks like she got away with it, too. She really do. Well, don't worry. We got a secret of our own. Oh, snap. Is this place nice? Oh, yeah, his place is kind of nice. It's kind of small, though. Oh, well, nothing wrong with us just taking a little peek around the place. Alejandro, why don't you come here? Let's measure the size of this bedroom since you said you wanted to, like, redecorate and whatnot. Papi, get over here, papi. Oh, yeah, baby. This is what I've been waiting for. Everyone's distracted, and we didn't have any alone time together. Mmm. We must make up for all the lost time. There we go. Yep. Mm-hmm. That's what I thought, baby. What? Does he not want to do stuff because his wife and kid are right there? That wasn't a problem when we was at his house. Anyway, the guy did say that the party's over. Raquel already went home. Wait, she went home without us? Oh, she's going home without us. Well, that was weird. Anyway, let's get back to the house. Um, I'm glad that we sued. I'm glad that we, uh... Went to the party, even though it didn't it didn't exactly go the way we wanted. Oh, now she wants a hot tub. Of course you do. Because you had so much fun in the hot tub with your man. We know. We know what it is. Like, they don't know, but I know. Y'all know. Y'all, the fans, y'all know what's happening. We know she been cheating. It's okay, honey. We all got secrets. You keep yours, we'll keep ours. You know, you're drumming and whatnot. We're, we're going to stop listening to you, though. Goodbye. But trust me, all secrets come out eventually. All dirty secrets come out. Ew, speaking of dirty, he stink. Maybe that's why Raquel didn't want to be all over him tonight. Oh, well, whatever. We're still heading home. And his smell is revolting. Anyway, we're out. Bye. It was kind of an odd party. It was like, do you want us in your house? Your house is too small for a party. Like, why is Raquel, like, hanging out with this guy? He doesn't have money like that. He's just, like, a normal guy, just like Maria said when she tried to date him. Maybe that's why she wants to date him. He's not in the public eye. It'd be easy to have an affair with him. Maybe that's why Alejandro's with her. She's not in the public eye. Nobody knows who she is. She's just a maid. No, I don't want to think like that. Alejandro has feelings for her that are real. We shouldn't doubt that. And one day he will leave his wife to be with us. You'll see. Okay, we are finally back home. It looks like everyone's hungry, so Maria's gonna have to cook for everyone. Because the guy didn't even have food at the party. What kind of party is it where you don't have food? That's crazy. I'm gonna serve everyone sushi. Sushi 
is like really good on like a summer day when you want like a nice light snack. I'm gonna send everyone to the showers, to the bathroom. Alejandro's gonna have to wait his turn. He's still mad because he lost friends because of the scandal that broke out or whatever, but it wasn't his fault. We sued for slander, we got the money, but it didn't fix his relationship with his friends, unfortunately. Maria's gonna start making everybody dinner. She wanted to be with Alejandro today so badly, though. But, like, everything kept getting in the way. He had to go sue. He went to the party and all that kind of stuff. Well, at least tomorrow is a regular work and school day. So, Maria will get all the time with her man that she needs. Let's kick it up a notch. And then we'll invite the entire household to come eat. And he's done. He's gonna need to wash up. So, is Maria. We're all gonna eat together. No one's ever gonna tell Maria that she can't eat at the family table ever again. I mean, come on, she helped raise his boy. Plus, she's sleeping with the man of the house. I think that gets her a seat at the family table. Raquel's actually sitting next to Maria. Uh, that's awkward. Let's not stay in that seat too long. Mm -mm. Let's go. <laughs> Honey, did you eat? Did you get your food? Let's put these leftovers away if you did already. Did he get his food? He got his food. Just wanted to make sure. Don't want our baby being hungry. Okay, we put all the food away. We doing the damn thing. We know how to do our job. Oh, no. Did we set it up so that she accidentally going through the wrong bathroom? Oh, no. We'll fix it. Not that we have mine. <laughs> All she want to do is drink nowadays. Is she, like, that depressed? Or something? I don't know. Cause her whole thing is like, oh, I just want to drink. I just want to drink. Well, Maria's just finishing up putting away the dishes and whatnot. Oh, and Charles is helping her because he is such a sweetie. Um, is everyone good now? Yeah, everyone's good. Everyone's just heading off to bed. Everyone's going to bed early, so probably everyone will wake up early, which means, unfortunately, Maria will have to wake up extra early to get everything ready for them. We don't even need a shower. We just need to go to the bathroom really bad. So after we send her to the bathroom, we're just going to send her to bed. And then uh, tomorrow morning, everyone's going back to work. Everyone's going back to school. Uh... Alejandro has to worry about his business stuff because we just messed up his relationship with some of his friends because of that scandal that hit. But hopefully everything will be fine. And then I think Saturday, we should talk to Alejandro about going away for the weekend. You know, I mean, because of our sick abuela. <laughs> and of course, his business meeting. We'll need some time off for all those things. So is he going to come in here shirtless again? Really, Alejandro? You know what? Maria's missing that body, though. They have not woohooed in a whole day. I'm sorry, that may not sound like a lot, but Maria needs it. She missed spending time with Alejandro. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Mrs. Solano is busy watching TV. Let's take advantage of this moment. I've been missing you, honey. Oh, Maria, I've been missing you, too. But we have to be more careful. I can't afford another scandal. <laughs> 